Hey you guys, it's your girl, The Empress 917, and I'm coming to you with another one. My bun is a little, don't even worry about it. You already know spirit is in the building, okay? I'm coming on here with some energy for today. You know, I've been feeling my energy being pulled, pulled, pulled. Um, spirit is really revealing things to me about people around me and people that I was dealing with, things of that nature. So, you know, this is the age of revealing. I really believe 2020 and 21, 2020 and 2021 were revealing years for me. So, I don't know if you all are going through the same thing, but they were I op th these years were eye-opening years for me. Like the people I was dealing with, friends, family, or foe, I won't be dealing with anymore. You know, this is another ascension in my life. I was dealing with people beforehand, but now God is showing me, okay, now you can't take these people with you either. So it's like, okay, cool. And so I was a little in my feelings about that situation. I don't know why I'm telling y'all this, but I was in my feelings about that situation maybe you know I, I need to talk about it but and then I understood you know I had to go come back to myself because for a minute I'm not gonna lie I'm a spiritual reader I am I'm, I'm very spiritual but we got issues too and so I had to take some steps back and I had to start writing like the pros and cons and when the the cons outweigh the pros I have to understand okay this isn't for me anymore <clears throat> so I've been that's what I've been doing in my life and you know I've been really tough on myself because I was letting myself um, go back into uh, like a, a mindset that I didn't want to go back into so I had to get on up on my P's and Q's <clears throat> and I had to start to understand where I am and where I want to be and where I'm going and so anyway I told y'all that to say that you know if you're feeling stuck in a situation or you're feeling stuck around people with bad energy or you're feeling stuck like you know people gossiping and talking let them gossip because when people throw stones, that means that you have something that you, you want to keep up off of you. You don't want the attention to be on you. Um, when people throw stones at your name, that's what's going on. They living in glass houses. And if you throw a stone at them, you probably break and shatter the whole damn house. But I'm like, I, I'm a type of person that I know some dirt about you. And I won't even say anything. Because I don't get, I, I don't get anything from it. But I say all that to say this, you guys, you know, don't be afraid to make moves, whatever move it is. Um, I'm always moving on God's faith. I don't move on nobody else's faith. So, you know, and I always speak of God because that's who I am. And, you know, some people do it for show, but I'm real about mine. And I don't, I don't feel like I have to say that I'm real because... I, I exude that and I show that every day by the way I live my life, by the way I try to do people right, by the way I try to, um, I just do, you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, gossiping and things of that nature, it may be some gossip going on about you. People are watching you, they're trying to figure out what you're doing because you're working so hard, okay? And people are, um, they're, they're intimidated by this. They're intimidated that you're that you that you are that the good news is coming in that you are laying burdens down. They're 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 intimidated by you laying your burdens down, y'all. And a lot of people are um, scared when you do so because they feel like you're going to end things with them and you're going to start a new life and you're going to go ahead and leave them out basically. And so. A lot of things that you're doing, you're going to have to start doing solo, okay? 
don't let anybody know what's going on with you because I feel like um, a, a lot going on this weekend. I feel like it's a lot of gossip on your name and you don't even know it. Um, and I might be even talking about myself right now, but it really doesn't matter about what people got to say. Because then I say you're going to be single, abundant, and free and doing things on your own because these people are not for you. They're trying to keep you stuck. Okay? They're not for you. And these people, they may have, um, they may do care about you, but they sh they have a funny way of showing it, you guys. So you got to understand that, um, Ooh, Spirit, you coming through and you you speaking to me as well. So you got to understand, you know, to try to keep keep yourself on top and keep yourself doing whatever you got to do and don't fall into um, any traps. You know what I'm saying? Because there are some traps that there has there has been traps set for me. You know, and I had to take a step back and say, "Ooh, wait a minute, don't even you know go there because it's just." It's just the enemy stepping in and trying to make you feel a certain type of way. You know what I'm saying? Because these people are wounded people. They can't even sleep at night because they can't even look in the mirror and look at themselves and understand what's going on with them. They're the ones that's stuck in a crossroad, but they're trying to keep you there. They want to keep you where they are. Okay? And this is what's going on this weekend. You got to understand there's some fake people in the building. Okay? There's some fake people in the building. I got up with this on my mind. It's some fake people in the building. I said, is, is it a, is a, is it a um, reading from me, Spirit? Or is it for my collective? And Spirit said, do it because it's for the both of you. You and your collective. So, I just feel like um, <clears throat> there's a lot of people come in, act like they're family, act like this good, act like they got emotions and things of that nature for you. But the thing is, the only reason why they're doing that, and then they penny pinch you. They penny pinch you and or 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 breadcrumb you on everything because they feel like you're so balanced out and you you're so grounded. That's why people try to stay around you and people people can see your blessing before you can and they see you you're about to have a new stable beginning and these people are wondering why what they're investing in isn't so lucrative for them it's because you're always trying to set traps up for somebody else you're always doing things to other people that um they're just not that it's not right and spirit is blowing a whistle on everybody and they're, they're they're letting you know they're understanding i mean they're blowing the whistle on everybody spirit is blowing the whistle and they're trying to make you understand that everybody is not who they are around you pay attention is what spirit said okay pay attention because people are coming at you like they're they're so friendly and love and and things of that nature and they they are they have a motive the motive is to break you down operation break you down operation keep you stuck operation keep you oh you think your shit don't stink so operation um i'm a, i'm gonna make your shit stink so that's what's going on right now they're masking people are masking things okay they're masking things Come on, spirit. This one wanted to come out. Yeah. And they know that you are a fighter. You stand up for yourself no matter what. You you may, even if you need somebody's help, you, you don't have, that's not your only option. And people don't understand that. So now, you've been intellectually thinking about it. You're going into solitude about it because spirit has been pulling on you, telling you about it. Your intuition is on fleek right now. And you're cutting some things out and people out. Yeah. People that are in and out with their feelings and emotions, you're about to move on with that. Whether it be family, friend, or foe, you're about to move on from that. People that are trying to stop your manifestations, they can't because spirit is right here behind you. Spirit is all over you. Spirit got you. Because they don't that, that's what they don't understand. These are spiritual beings right here. This is all spiritual. Spiritual. Spiritual spirituality this magician has everything this magician needs you don't need anybody you may think you need somebody but you don't because you're the star and regardless you're going to have a rebirth in life because you are a caring loving person and you are healing from all of your past wounds and confusions that you've been in yeah you're about to end this cycle with everybody that's trying to give you small offers and trying to hold on to you because you give good offers and, and you're about to leave all these people behind because you're stepping into your power you're nurturing yourself the empress is leaving huh <laughs> 
the empress has left the building. The empress is closing the door on a whole lot of situations. By the empress, I mean it's me and you. Okay? That's what's up. Because you're loving yourself right now. You're loving yourself right now. You're pouring into yourself. You're not pouring into these people anymore. And it's going to make these people upset. And they're going to rush into you trying to be your friend. And, and we're going to go out. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. Let's do this. Let's do that. No. Spirit said no. Cut them out. Leave them out in the cold. Because that's what they're trying to do to you. This is your justice so you can get your wish fulfillment. See, now is a test in time where you got to turn your back on all of these people that said they were your friends and said this and said that all of these fake apologies that they've been giving you and fake things that they've been just fake people. They're fake. And what's happening is you're about to balance some things out and you're about to get what your wish fulfillment is and your happiness. And you're going to leave these people in tower moments. See, when you're gone, they don't have shit to blame anybody else on but themselves. See, they crown, been, the crown fell off, but you're the empress. Your crown is on. You have mastered everything. And the thing is, people around you don't like it. But guess what? <laughs> Death, ending, transition. It's time to move on because your new beginning is coming. And it's going to be wish fulfillment for you. Okay? Yeah. Whatever's coming to you is meant to come to you. It's meant. It was written. It was already in the ethos. Ethos. Because you're strong. And spirit knows that. And spirit's going to send you all kind of collaborations. And guess what? You're stepping into your masculine and feminine power right now. You're about to step into your, your, your masculine power because it's faded. And what you have to do is... Hmm. You got to run an empire. So you got to leave these people alone. Okay? Yeah, and they're going to be so stuck. The secret is they're so stuck that they're lying and deceiving about you because they're at a loss and regret for the shit that's going on in their life, and they don't even like it. They don't even like it, but they know that you're so passionate and you're about to have a new passion in the beginning. That's leaving them upset, too, okay? They know that you're the queen of wands as well. You're, you're going to get up and you're going to do your thing. You're going to juggle your life the way it's supposed to go. And you're going to make that shit happen no matter what. And that's what they mad about. Yeah. Devilish energy. They want to take you down because they see that your money is about to be flowing. They got all eyes on you because they know that you're about to have a victory. Yeah. And this is the truth, Spirit said. Truth. Straight up truth. You don't have time for it anymore. Yeah. You're leaving people that's been masking their emotions. That's causing you conflict and confusion just because their life is shit. You're stepping out there on your new beginning and you're not even going to communicate with these people anymore because they tried to keep you stuck and stagnant, okay? You're choosing to love yourself and you're blocking out all things that are in and out of your life talking about they love you but they really don't. This is friends, family, and foe. You're about to break a lot of hearts. Because you're about to separate. Yeah. Yeah. And they're mad. They're going to be holding on still watching you. Being in their energy. Watching you. Their job is to watch you and try to stop you. And that's why they're going to be so into what you're doing. If somebody is so into what you're doing and you know they act funny with you, don't tell them anything about you. Matter of fact, whatever your plans are, keep them to yourself because people don't have your good interests at heart. Okay, Spirit can put that on me because these people are burdened. They are burdened. And they're burdened with their own shit and they try to put it on you. Uh-huh, Spirit put it on me this morning. Okay, please and thank you, Spirit. What is the advice for the collective? Yeah. You need to rush in with your truth and find out. Rush in with your truth and let people know what's up. And guess what? You're loving yourself no matter what. Put that love into yourself. Fuck putting that love into other people. Excuse my language. But it is what it is. You know, people, even when they try to come back, don't do it. Because you're manifesting a new beginning. You're manifesting a new beginning. These are people who are actively trying to break you down. But spirit got your back and they don't even know it. You hold on to spirit more than you hold on to anything else. And that's what they jealous of. Okay. They know that spirit got your back regardless. Okay. That's all I have to say for you all today. Um, 
it's going to be some people that's about, about to be exposed. Uh, they're about to be exposed. And the thing is, when you rip them drawers off of them and they expose, what's going to happen is you're going to see. You're going to see what's going on around you. You and, 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 and the thing is, you don't even have to rip it. Spirit is going to show you. You don't even have to. You don't have to search for it. You don't have to look for it. You don't have to people around no you don't have to do anything spirit is going to present it to you right here in your face now what you're going to do with it is what spirit is going to say because you don't deserve anything but greatness and if somebody can't give it to you because they upset about how you're trying to move forward in your life or they upset because their shit is in shambles and you are trying to clean up your shit in any way possible when they get upset like that baby all you got to do is tell them it's not about you it's not about you. It's not even about me. It's the way God wants to use me. And people are upset about that. People are upset about it. They're upset about your talents. They're upset about who you are. They're upset about how you maneuver. They are upset. And how do I know? Because I'm going through the same thing and experiencing the same thing. But Spirit said you got rid of family that's no good. Now it's time to get rid of friends that are no good. So anyway, you guys, I love you. I love you. Love you. And till we meet again, protect yourself. Stay peaceful. You know what I'm saying? No matter what, try not to go back into old ways. Because I'm telling you, I slipped into an old way. And I said, hold on, hold on, hold on, spirit. Get me together. So that's all I have for you guys you all have a wonderful wonderful day I'll be back later and enjoy this rainy day I'm, well it's raining here where I am I'm going to enjoy this rain and ask spirit to cleanse whatever that is in my life that is not for me Clean, cleanse it out open my third eye and let me see straight make me understand what's going on close my two eyes so I can see with this third one because it's time to wreck shop it's time alright y'all I love you